Hey guys, this is a quick video to confirm that the Verizon um, LG G5 does work on T-Mobile. I put my SIM card in here, and um, it's it says 3G there, but it goes back and forth between LTE. Uh, but let me uh, do uh, 611 here. I tested it out before. It doesn't have the um, 1700 band for 3G, but it does have the LTE band. T-Mobile. See. So it does work on Verizon. Uh, some people uh, asked me, I saw comments, a comment in the other video, and I thought, you know what, instead of just telling them this, I better power it on and, and show them. So uh, in the settings, though, I changed the APN settings because uh, when you first put it in, put your SIM card in there, it's going to tell you that it's not a Verizon SIM card. Uh, and so um, you can change it to all these different ones here. If you put it on global, you'll get 3G or HSPA+. Plus. Um, but, um, it actually works. So let me go to the APN settings. It does pick up LTE, but here are the settings that I put in. You see, it's kind of has the H plus and it goes, but it does get LTE. I'm going to change it to another one on here and, and, uh, see, uh, but nonetheless, here it is. Here are the settings. This is what you need to put in. If you decide to pick up a Verizon version, if you want this color, and then here are the, so you can get picture mail. And then the rest of this is, you need to put this one in too. And then that's pretty much it. These other ones will pre-fill. Um, mm -hmm. <clears throat> and that's it. And you'll have your Verizon uh, version on the, um, T-Mobile network, so the internet does work. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to some tech stuff. I was on it earlier, and I was like, okay, well, then it's good. Hopefully, it'll work now. And I'm on. Uh, I might have to change that APN setting back. The uh, thing on there, but it does work. I was surfing earlier. Yeah, let me see here. I made some changes in here. I think I did. Yes, no sir. Oh, it says no service. I'm gonna change this to the. If you put it on global, you'll get more. Um, you'll get more uh, 3G and more consistent service. But if you put it on LTE and then you leave an LTE network, uh, like the, from the 1700 band, you won't get the good fast speeds. So as you can see here, I changed it to the LTE one, and I'm, I'm in an LTE area, so. I'm getting the the LTE speeds and everything. Let me just do a quick speed test and see. Sorry if you hear background noise. Still getting the house done. All right, let's see what the speeds are like. Oh, network communication. So might not be able to uh, get it. I saw it in Dallas. Let's see, it's changing to. Oh, it's picking us all. It's picking up. Let's see if we can actually get one. Now, I'm not able to pick up any speed tests. It's kind of weird, but the internet does work. Everything uh, everything works like it should, as you can see. I don't know if this is just the application and confused. I don't know, uh, but it does work. And that's really the most important part, that you actually have some LTE service. So there you have it. The Verizon LTE um, does work, and the Verizon G5 does work on T-Mobile. It's just why I got it. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.